Hello there, now I'm in the operations centre at the Met Office, the HQ down in Exeter, and I've been joined by the chief forecaster today, Paul Gunderson. We're talking Storm Ophelia. Right, give us the latest on Storm Ophelia, Paul. Right, right now here's a satellite picture showing the centre of the storm, very close now to southwest Ireland, with very strong winds on its southern flank, now approaching uh, southern parts of the Republic of Ireland. Now talk us through the strongest winds and when they're going to be and where. Now the strongest winds in terms of numbers like to be 60 to 70 miles an hour quite widely, locally up to 80 miles an hour on some exposed coast. The strongest of those at the moment are across the southern parts of the Republic of Ireland, but they all transfer through the Irish Sea, so by the middle part of today, uh, approaching southwestern parts of Wales, by late afternoon, sort of North Wales, particularly Anglesey, the Clean Peninsula, and then this evening into parts of the east of Northern Ireland with 70 to 80 mile an hour gusts, just perhaps even into the Belfast area. It's a very, very strong wind. Okay, so when we're talking strong winds, up to 80 miles an hour, what is the risk associated with that? Well, high risk, we're looking at damage to buildings, trees uprooted, uh, a lot of disruption to transport, and more importantly, uh, a risk of loss of life as well. Well, so what's the advice? The advice really is to stay indoors. Mm -hmm. Okay, so then when does this storm clear, which is probably the most important thing? Now, overall, the peak winds will be slowly reducing as the storm runs northwards and weakens, but it'll still be very windy into tonight, notably so for parts of North Wales, Northern England, southwestern parts of Scotland, and then through the course of tonight and tomorrow, that's early Tuesday, the strongest of the winds become confined to northeastern parts of England by the early part of Tuesday. Elsewhere, a gradual reduction in the winds through that period or slightly. Thanks very much, Juan. Well, you are really busy, and we will keep you updated, obviously, on our social media channels and also on our website.